Hello, beautiful people of Eorzea. My name is Digital Storms, also known as Raven Dusk. And in today's video, we'll be discussing Endwalker, a non spoiler review for all of you. Personally, I don't even know where to begin as this expansion was phenomenal. I do think this expansion is going to be heavily split down the middle, whether it was better than Shadowbringers or not. But my god, what a journey and a fantastic journey and beautiful storytelling, especially towards the end. It just gets so phenomenal. You're sucked in and once it has your claws in you, it does not let go. I found myself crying on quite a few occasions, to be perfectly honest, and I'm not quite a big crier, but it did hit me pretty hard, especially certain moments. They definitely hit me super, super hard, and, you know, rightfully so. They were, it was fantastic writing. I, the dungeons are phenomenal. I think the first and second one are pretty good, but I also think that Shadowbringers was better uh, for the first two dungeons. And then I think the third dungeon in Endwalker is when they start getting really, really good. Personally, that's my personal opinion. And the trials are phenomenal. They're better than the trials in Shadowbringers already, and I love them. I don't care what anyone says, my personal opinion. It is spectacular, and I hope they continue to be so. Moving back to the story, I did want to say I thought it started off a little slow, and then it ramps up and then it catches you and holds you tight and dear and you just don't want it to end and then it ends and it's amazing it's a journey it really is a journey the new combat is amazing all the classes feel pretty good i'm sure there's some people that don't like certain things but that's them this is what i'm saying from what i've experienced i've loved gunbreaker and it's I, lo I, I do regret not going for the story as a Dragoon, but I'm kind of glad I went with Gunbreaker as well. Um, but this game is a journey. It really is a journey. And it's not just about the MSQ. It's not about the dungeons. It's not about the savage content. Yes, it is to an extent, but it's also about the journey. The friends we make along the way and holding them close. The people we meet in trial roulettes and, and everyday content. People we speak to. New people we meet on this game and... New friends we make, they may be worlds apart, but I'm sure most of them would have your back if you asked them to. There are some people who aren't, you know, amazing, but the few are outweighed by the many, many good souls in this game. And I want to take a moment to just clarify, whether you're a 1.0 character, or you're just starting out today on A Realm Reborn, welcome and thank you for being with us, and continue your journey. Make new friends, laugh, hold them close, whether you're playing for a friend, or playing only just because you want to play, give it a go. Whether you're still playing because a loved one is no longer here and has departed for the ethereal sea, and you want to keep their memory alive by playing their character or just living in the world they lived in, we need you to stay. This community is amazing, and you're amazing for playing this game. I mean that. This video may not reach any kind of viewership, I do not care, I just want to say that you're all amazing, you all deserve every happiness, and this game has a lesson to teach you all. Keep those close, always keep your friends close, and keep everybody safeguarded that you love, within reason. <laughs> Without being a dick, of course. I don't know if I covered the music, uh, I'm gonna reiterate though, the music was absolutely phenomenal. There wasn't one point where I hated the music at all. Every song, every track, banger after banger, no fucking rest. Absolutely perfect. I couldn't ask for a better soundtrack. The future is bright for this game, and it may end. It may end one day, but today it's not going to end. And for the foreseeable future, it's not going to end anytime soon. And I'm so glad because this game has made me feel things that, you know, nothing else has. And it's a cliche to say, oh, well, this game saved me. This game helped me through shit times and stuff like that. But this game has done that for me. This game has done so much for me. It's done a lot for my mental health. It's done a lot for my uh, thought process as well on how I view stuff. But playing this game changes you whether you like it or not. And I'm sure long after this expansion, we'll have another expansion, and I'll be making this video again. But this is my milestone video. I'm so happy to be, you know, a content creator. Big or small, it does not matter to me. I don't make money from of this. 
And I'm gonna be starting a new journey soon, another playthrough from Realm Reborn all the way to Endwalker. And it's gonna be live on Twitch and we're gonna experience something, you know, crazy, a long journey. We're gonna see how it all unfolded and it's gonna be amazing to experience all over again. And I'm gonna love every second of it and cherish it. Every journey has its struggles. And I'm sure what they're trying to tell us with this game is no matter how much you struggle, keep moving forward, keep putting your best foot forward. Even when you think all is lost, miracles happen every day. I don't have much more to say other than thank you all for watching. You're amazing people. I hope to see you out on Excalibur sometime. As you all know, I've been Digital Storm, aka Raven Dusk. Peace out. Love you guys. Stay strong. Stay beautiful. Stay wise, my friends.